Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Leo. This is for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for the week of February 8th through the 14th. So keep in mind that the timing is fluid and not every reading is for you, okay? Not every reading is for you. Um, I do apologize for the noise in the background. I am going to be getting some soundproofing, but it's probably going to take me a month to get it all set up. So, yeah, what do we have for Leo? What do we have for Leo for February 8th through the 14th? What do we have for Leo? We will take those. door. Opportunities are waiting for you. There's a new doorway that is opening. Career. It may have something to do with your career. Probably does by the looks of things. Lightning. Control your anger or you will be sorry. So this is a message that this is this is a big message right here. There's consequences, okay? There's consequences. That's what that means. Okay, so control your anger or you will be sorry. So that's something that you need to take away in the next week, from the 8th to the 14th. If you don't control yourself, there could be some repercussions. And the repercussions could come at any time. So there's opportunities that are waiting for you, may have something to do with your career. Five of Gabriel, or Gabriel, whatever, however you want to say it. A challenge you can resolve. Withdraw from the trauma of others. Have patience with yourself and those around you. Have patience. Now this is, this is the five of wands. You need to withdraw from the drama. Don't play. This is a highly competitive energy. Remove yourself from the situation. Don't play. Don't play the game. For if you do, you may be sorry. So this is the five of wands. My advice to you is to remove yourself from the situation before you get hit. What does lightning do? It hits you. burns you so anyhow you are gonna have to be careful this week you can choose to fight and get involved in a competition or you can choose to not engage that is a message that you need to hear Maybe you should focus on your job, your career instead. What do we have for Leo? What do we have for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? Whew, could be dealing with a Capricorn. Doesn't have to be. This is unhealthy. This is ego. This is greed. This is manipulation. This is living in shadow. This is living in hell. So the devil is a bond that you need to break. You need to break a bond. You need to sever ties with something that is unhealthy. It's not going to be easy because it feels so good. The control, the manipulation, the feelings. It feels so good to have that control. It's so, hmm, somebody really needs to break free from some sort of attachment there's an attachment here. There is definitely an attachment. It is hell. It is absolutely hell. And there's consequences. All is not as it seems with the devil. The devil is ruled by the shadow. 
okay? So there's something here, you know, that isn't all it's cracked up to be. And you might get instant gratification. That's all the devil brings is instant gratification, nothing long term. Before you know it, you'll be living in hell. So anyhow, I feel like this week you need to remove yourself from a situation that is toxic, that is unhealthy, that you are still tied to at this time. You need to remove yourself from the situation. You need to take back control. You need to take back control of yourself. Remove yourself from this unhealthy situation. Focus on your job. Focus on your work. Focus on the future. Let go of the past. Get prepared for something better. Work on yourself. Work on your job. You know, get prepared. Get prepared for whatever it is that you truly, truly need in your life. Do not look back unless you want to go back to hell. Anyhow, Three of Wands, this is get prepared. Focus on the future. Something is coming. It is coming. Something that you have been waiting for is coming. But you, if you, if you go down the wrong path, and you engage yourself with whoever this person is that is unhealthy, you will be taking a step backwards. You will. Oh my God, there's your step backwards. Unbelievable. This is definitely going backwards. You're stuck. You're dealing with somebody that is holding you back from success. Focus on the future. Stop wasting your time. You're wasting your time. You, you've, you've made a, somebody's made a poor decision. I mean, that two of wands reversed, that's a poor decision. They're, they've made a poor choice to engage themselves with something that is toxic and unhealthy. I see some sort of expansion, something, somebody expanding. They could be moving, they could be traveling, and it working out. Something working out. This, they, you know, the, if this is career related, things are going to work out if you can focus on the future. Don't, don't go backwards. There's, there's, there's ego here. There's lust. There's greed. There's materialism. There's temptation. There's, somebody is really tempted to go down the wrong path. This is literally the wrong path. This is tempted. They are tempted to go down the wrong path. You are going to have to master your emotions big time this week. Make sure you are not in your ego. Make sure you're, you are not in your dark side. Somebody's in their darkness. They are in a period of darkness. They're in a deep, dark place. And they're wanting instant gratification. And that insta instant gratification is going to cause problems. Be, control your anger. You will be sorry. I'm telling you what. There is, you're going to be put into a circumstance where you're going to have to make a choice. And you better choose wisely. If I was you, I'd be focusing on your job, focusing on your work, focusing on your career, focusing on your future. Do not go back to hell. To satisfy your ego or, or you know, this the ego. Devil is ego. Knight of Swords. Now, this is somebody who takes swift action. Um, this is a risk taker. Information, truth, law officials. There could be some law officials that are that are heading in this week. Could be somebody even in protective protective services. I don't know. Uh, the, I don't know. Knight of Swords could be somebody that has to do with the law. That has some sort of information. Has some sort of truth. Um, Knight of Swords, somebody rushing in very, very fast, in a hurry. This person is on a mission. They are on a mission. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, energy. Uh, taking a new approach. Oh my God. Wheel of Fortune reverse. Now that's a horrendous loss of some sort. Going backwards. Repeating negative mistakes. Repeating uh, 
the same things over and over and over again. Somebody keeps repeating their cycles. They do. They haven't, they haven't learned. You need to take a new approach. You need to smarten up. Some Not being mean or anything. In uh, Vedic astrology, I am Leo rising. So anyhow, Knight of Swords. This is, this is be wise. Be smart. Be smart. Take a new approach. Do not engage. Do not go backwards. You have been, somebody's been going backwards and that this is negative repetitive patterns. This is a shocking, unpredictable loss. You could be, somebody could be, it could be, it could be that person. Some, I don't know who it is. You or somebody that you're dealing with is probably going to have a, you know, a setback of some sort because of a poor choice. Setback, poor choice, temptation, ego, control, manipulation because of ego. Somebody's going to have a, have a setback because of their ego. Remove yourself from the situation. Do not engage. This person may be coming at you full throttle. Okay, this person may be coming at you full throttle or you're going after them. Somebody's, this is full throttle, you know. Oh, this is a battle of some sort. You're going to be battling with somebody. Five of Swords, that's a battle. That, so, yeah, there's some sort of battle. There's defeat. There's betrayal. Wanting to win at all costs. We got somebody here that doesn't care who they hurt just as long as they win. Whoever this person is is going to be experiencing a major setback. And it's because of their ego. It's because of their pride. Okay, because they want to fight. We got both of these cards are fighting competition. This one and this one, and and they want to control. So we got somebody who wants to control a situation. They want to fight. I feel like there's somebody that has some sort of uh, information or has some sort of authority. That's what it is. This person has some sort of authority. That is, I don't know if this is some sort of investigation or what. Five of Swords. Five of Swords underneath that Knight of Swords is somebody who is taking action, you know, is saying something on a mission, on a mission to win at all costs. We got somebody here that's on a mission to win at all costs. And whoever this person is, they are about to, oh my God, I don't, with the Wheel of Fortune reverse, they are about to lose. It's not, it's an unfortunate loss. It is a, a very unfortunate loss. Six of Wands reverse, no victory, no success, no progress. This is a no. This is this is um Definitely still fighting, wanting to fight. The battle isn't over. Somebody wants to fight, 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 fight. Unbelievable. I'm telling you what. Whoever this person is that wants to fight, 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 is going to lose. They're going to lose. And they're going to lose more than they bargained for. This is definitely a loss of some sort. Losing a battle. Somebody is trying really, 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 really hard to win something. It's all about power and control. It's all about this is power and control. This is power and control. And they're in a hurry. They're rushing. They're moving very, very fast. They're on a mission. Somebody is definitely on a mission. They're on a mission to win at all costs. And I feel like they're about to lose something. Anyhow, three of wands. Get prepared for an arrival. I think there's an arrival. There's going to be some sort of arrival or a departure. There could be a departure as well. It could be an arrival or a departure. Ace of Cups. Ace of Cups is love. It's a new start in love. It's, it is. I mean, the Ace of Cups is fantastic. Get prepared for an arrival that is emotionally fulfilling. This is all about love. It's all about emotional fulfillment. 
So get prepared for some emotional fulfillment. That's what you should be focusing on. And this could be self-love. You should be focusing on a new start in love. You should be focusing on emotional fulfillment. Focusing on the future. Not fighting with whoever this person is that is egotistical. You got somebody here that is egotistical. Maybe it could be you. Okay? I don't know. There's somebody here that is very, very egotistical that wants to control a situation and manipulate and lie. And I feel like whoever this person is, they're they're highly competitive with the five of wands right above the devil. This is somebody who, you know, as long as they get the gratification that they won, that's all that matters. It doesn't matter who they hurt. This person is going, the person that is doing that action is going to be having the loss. That's the person that is having loss. And it is a big one. It is a big loss. I feel like there's a sudden departure or it well, was a sudden departure or a sudden arrival. There's also um, a new opportunity for love with the Ace of Cups because that's what the Ace of Cups is. This is, a, this is, this is about love. This is the hand of God giving somebody an opportunity for happiness and love and emotional fulfillment. And that is what matters. Focus on the future. Focus on love. Don't fight. One more card. King of Wands. Now the King of Wands is somebody that is your energy, is somebody that is a visionary, gets a new vision, takes action. Uh, very confident. Find your confidence, find your strength and your courage. Do the right thing. We have somebody here that is very experienced, that is making a decision. And it is a person in a position of authority. It's interesting because I saw that earlier. I feel like we have, I don't know who this person is. Somebody is making a decision based on some sort of facts, based on the truth. There's a lack of success, there's a lack of growth, there's a lack of victory because somebody has been very unhealthy. They've been, they haven't been healthy. The devil's not healthy. But a decision is going to be made based on the facts, based on the truth. There's been too much fighting, too much arrogance. We have somebody here that is extremely arrogant and we have an experienced individual that can see, that can see that this is unhealthy. King of Wands is very experienced. That could be your energy. It could be. Um, but this is a person that is older, that is in their, I feel like, you know, this is in their 50s or maybe even older. This is an older person that is making a decision. It could be somebody that is very, very mature, you know, mature for their age. Somebody is making a decision. And it has to do with uh, suddenly going in a new direction. Something very sudden here. I feel like there's gonna be a sudden change Somebody comes in out of nowhere. You know, they come in, and if you're single, I mean, this could have to do with love. If you're, if you're single, there could be a, somebody coming in with an offer of love, okay? This is somebody that comes out of nowhere, okay? So there could be somebody that comes in with an offer of love, and this person comes out of nowhere, okay? This could be a fire sign, like yourself, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Could be Capricorn. Uh, could be anybody, um, whatever this is, somebody is, is in a hurry They're, and they are, have strong desire. Okay. This could be a, a, a week of strong desire as well. You know, where you, there's desires that need to be met and, you know, desires that need to be fulfilled and you just need to be careful. Okay. I, I do, I do want to say, be careful. I do. Don't rush into anything. Don't rush. And I feel like there is somebody that is in a hurry. Somebody is definitely, definitely, definitely in a hurry. This could be somebody that has betrayed you. They have already betrayed you because I see betrayal here. 
Um, you're probably going to be receiving some communication from somebody. Um, maybe this person wants to put in effort. Maybe they didn't put in effort in the past. They want to put in effort now. Maybe they're seeing this as a horrendous loss. You know, um, this could, I could go on all day with this reading. Anyway, Leo, I feel like you have an opportunity for happiness here. But I do not think that you should be focusing on the past or focusing on any dark energy or people that bring drama to your life. Good luck.